welcome to Sobi Media. This is the launch of uh, a Samoyedian all regional game. This event will be happening all over. Baby Jack is in. Baby 
steps in the building. This is steps in the building. We call him after.
And the whole Yasi. The whole Yasi. The whole Yasi. Champion. The whole Yasi. Yeah, many years ago, um, it's something I've been thinking of. Um, what can I do beyond football? Or what can I do to improve sports? Because um, after school, we, we all saw everything in the past, talking about this in TACO, colleges and everything going down and um, nothing has been done. So it's something I've been planning for like a decade. But my problem was how to implement it. So it's something I've been contemplating throughout all these years. And lo and behold, um, I said to myself, hey, whether hook or crook, I have to make this thing happen. And then um, coincidentally, I was contacted by <laughs> Original Games. You know, they also had the same plan 
affiliated to mine. And um, we had a couple of meetings and we decided to make it something bigger. So I had to share my ideas to them. And um, obviously they wanted to do female sports and everything, but with my ideas and everything, we decided to open it and then um, name it the all regional games. Uh, talking about going to the, all the 16 regions for, for the 16 regions to have their best team in all the disciplines. But because we have a short time, that we're gonna we're gonna do the um, sports festival, the national sports festival in November. Because we have a short time, we decided to um, do about nine disciplines, which involves football, athletics, boxing, volleyball, tennis, and what have you. And then we decided to bring um, the was it um the disabled the disabled that was the last minute plan we decided to and we feel like we had to add the disabled for them to be to feel welcome in the society and uh talking about myself i feel like um we need all these people to give them hope so we decided to add a disabled to make all this thing happen. And I'm sure um, if we make this thing successful, next year is gonna be great. Next year we're gonna open it. We're gonna add a lot of disciplines to it. Uh, sometimes some of the sports disciplines comes to my DM and I say, oh, why don't you bring this? Why don't you bring ours? I don't want to mention the discipline, but I do understand, but this is just the beginning. This is the first edition of the original games. So I can assure everybody in Ghana that let's make this successful. Let's make all regional games a successful one. Let, let's make it an institute. Let's make it something that our next generation will benefit from. Because we're not looking upon football. Football is the number one sport in Ghana, no doubt. But we are looking beyond football. We want to make sure all the sports disciplines can also benefit. So in future, when we go to Olympic Games, we won't depend only on football. We depend on different, different sports disciplines to make Ghana a huge um, sports country when it comes to sports. So me being here, I can say my, my soul is happy. The time is now. The time is now because it's been my dream. Although I'm a football player, ex-football player, who has done a lot in football, but I'm thinking about Ghana. I'm not thinking about only football. And obviously, I thank my colleagues for their support. I called Bukum Bankun. I spoke to him about the project, and he said, no, hey, what you are doing is very big. I'm coming here to support. Thank you, Bukum Bankun. Thank you, my colleagues, everybody for coming. Also, my, my school, when I was in Accra Academy, the only coach who saw my talent, Coach Jay Sapon, who is a legendary coach. For all these years, um, there were a bit of distance between us. You know, people were talking about me neglecting him and stuff. I've got a lot of things happening. I've been organizing events. Hey, let me leave everything and then come join because this is a huge thing. This is for Ghana. This is an institute. So why don't I add my experience to it? He came on board and he's here. Ajima <laughs> Bedu. He's been a brother. He's been a Somebody who's been very, very supportive. Stephen Apia has been very, very supportive since day one. Every event, I do invite them, John Pencil, Fatao Dauda, not only them, all my colleagues. Anytime I, I invite them to my event or any event that I'm associated to, they always make sure they are present. 
as you can see they are here. A round of applause to them. <laughs> When we talk about the original games, I urge every Ghanaian to support it. We are not here to come do one edition and then the following year you will hear of us again. I'm sure you have kids who are coming up. We are here to discover talent, not only football. We are also here people who cannot make it. We are here to support them to give them scholarships and everything to make sure without sports, they can even continue and better their education and become somebody for Ghana. And one important person here who um, I nearly forgot, he's the, one of the important people in our team, Mr. Kojo Fianu. He has been with the national team. When we talk about the national team from the Black Stars since I was young, he's the one who saw me during Stephen Apier's days, my brother's days. He's been somebody I do admire a lot. And he has done a lot in Ghana when it comes to sports. We had to contact him, share the ideas. We, even, we didn't even talk about even three things, and he jumped to it, and he said, listen, I mean, I'm here to support my son. I'm here to make the sports grow. It's something we've been thinking of, like the way I was thinking, but how to implement it was the problem. We had to sit for like seven months, sleepless nights, thinking about how we can improve sports in Ghana. And here we are now. As you can see, it's written, the time is now. So, Tell a friend to tell another friend benefit. So, all the corporate organizations who want to sponsor, make sure you come on. Let's sponsor this event to make Ghana a great one. Thank you so much for coming. Thank everybody in the media. Thanks, Franklin, my guy, who's come to talk about technicalities. Thanks to everybody. Who